The series is over and now we are being joined by New Zealand coach Gary Strait. Gary, obviously New Zealand has been able to win the series 1-0. Obviously not the ideal way, even if it means that you are undefeated on home soil since 2019. You'd have wanted, you know, to defeat India more convincingly, more cricket. Uh, yeah, I mean, we can't help the weather and what happened there and, and that's unfortunate I think for the series because uh, it's always great when you play India and, and uh, you see some fantastic players over on our shores as well and I think we played some pretty good cricket out there uh, today we were pretty well placed before the, the rain came in as well but yeah it's just unfortunate I guess this time of the year the weather is a wee bit unpredictable in New Zealand. Uh, Gary, I just wanted one question because a debate is going on in India because of two talented, equally talented players, Sanju Samson and Rishabh Pant, both are wicket keepers. When you are a coach and you you face this kind of situation, how difficult it is to make a decision? Ah, it's very difficult because I mean the two players you you've just talked about are, are world class players and. We've seen the success that both both of them have had at different times for India and for their IPL franchises as well. So very difficult, I think, to make. Um, I guess for me, you, you try and show some loyalty to the person that's in the role and, and then you work out if it is time to change, then you want to make sure that the other person is, is definitely better than what you're replacing with. But that's tough when... when um, the situation you're in, because players do go through form up and down. I mean, they have different periods of being in and out of form at different times. So who should be doing the explaining job to the particular player that you are playing or someone is not playing, captain or coach? Is, is the, how, how the leadership will deal with that? Uh, we do it, the coach. So I, I do the conversations with the players, but the captains and senior leaders of the team are, are very positive influences in our team and, and, and they still get around and have good conversations with the players. My final question, Gary, you saw that uh, Indian, Indian, Indian team was here without the likes of Virat and Rohit and Bumbras. Whatever new players you saw, the young players in T20 and ODIs, two players each, one batsman and one bowler, you were very impressed with? Uh, well, obviously Umrah Malik has a, has a lot of pace and, and I guess, um, yeah, he, he certainly has enough pace to hurry a lot of players up and, and that's always exciting, I think, when you, you get to see fast bowlers bowling, especially at a ground like this at Hagley where the ball does fly through. And Look, I thought uh, throughout the series, I think Shubman Gill, to me, I haven't seen him play a lot of white ball cricket, but he, he certainly, I think, has the, the temperament and patience to be a fine opening bat for India for a long period of time. Thank you so much, Gary, and uh, hope to see you soon in India. Pleasure. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thanks.